Hello YouTubers, today I'm going to show you how to install the Realtek AC97 audio driver on Windows 10. And to prove to you that there is no driver in the computer, the speaker, the speaker icon is muted. And it's going to say, no audio output device installed. And in case you're wondering about what computer this is on, this is on a compact computer that was manufactured in 2005. Made to run on Windows XP Home Edition. <laughs> and this computer said yes to Windows 10. But the bad thing was, there was no audio output device installed. And yes, I have my 3.5mm jack plugged in. And this computer monitor has speakers built in. There's absolutely nothing. And this is the volume bar on my monitor. So, in case you're wondering about that. And if you have a Dell computer, don't be don't get tricked because sometimes Dell computers works by if you plug it in. If this is no audio output device plugged in or installed, it's because most Dell computers when you plug it in, it'll automatically detect that you plug something in and it'll unmute it and it'll just go into regular sound mode. But this is a pro different problem in my case, so I'm actually going to include this too in the description, the link to the download. So here's my AC97 files. This is everything to prove to you guys that's real. And make, let me make it bigger so you guys can see it. There's everything. And yes, this is everything that has to be installed on the computer. So I've already pasted it to my desktop here. I unzipped the zip file. And it will be in the zip archive in the drive too, so just be aware of that. So now, now that I showed you that, we're going to want to go to our settings right here. Let me zoom in. You're going to want to go to our settings. You're going to want to go to update and security. You're going to want to go to recovery. You're going to want to hit advanced startup. Hit restart now. You let it do its thing. And by the way, this computer is thinking loud, so just because it's got an old quantum hard drive. You're going to want to hit troubleshoot right here. Hit this. You're going to want to go to advanced options. And now. You're going to want to go to startup settings. And you're going to want to hit F7. Either F7 or just hit restart. Depending on how your computer acts with Windows 10. And it's just starting up. Compact right there. Just to prove to you guys. And ignore that message. It's just this computer's been bugging me about the fan, even though I've replaced it. And I gotta unplug the flash drive. Because this computer is extremely picky if you have flash drives. So I gotta hit control out the lead again. So just give it a few minutes. So now you get to this screen right here, you're going to want to hit F7. And what that will let you do is it will let you install unknown drivers to the system. And if you try to put the executable file in, it will make Windows 10 crash. So don't try to put executable files. You're going to have to manually put these files in. You're going to have to put that folder manually in through Device Manager, which I'll show you. Isn't that the loudest computer you ever heard before? The loudest computer you ever heard right there? That's hard to think it's really loud, you guys. So it's a, it's a big brainstorm thinker, I'll call it. 
So let's let it do its thing. There we go. And yes, I call it a test PC for this demonstration purpose only. So now, we're almost done. Now we gotta go to our device manager. You could easily go through that. You could go to that through File Explorer. You're gonna wanna hit this PC. And right at the top there, you're gonna wanna hit computer at the top tab there. A tab where it says file, hit computer. And hit system properties. And here's Windows 10 right here to prove to you guys. Now we're going to hit Device Manager. Now we're going to go to our unknown devices. And you're going to want to hit Multimedia Audio Controller. Right click on it. Hit Update Driver Software. Hit browse my computer for driver software. You're gonna wanna hit browse. Remember I put it on the desktop. It depends on where you put those files at. If you downloaded them too from the Google Drive, it will be in the downloads folder. You're gonna wanna go to desktop. Let me see, because I know I've done it before. Now let me let me figure this out real quick, because it's not responding right. So here. sorry for the screw up. So I got it right here. Back to the desktop. You're gonna want to click this folder right here. Realtek AC97. Click OK. Hit next. And now it's installing the driver software. There's supposed to be some message popping up saying can't verify the the installer. Yeah, this one right here. You're gonna want to hit click install driver anyways. Let it load. And there you go, you guys. That's how you install real tech AC97 and actually too the speakers unmuted down there now so now we could actually you know let the volume control load there we go but I want to show you that the media player will work so I'll play some copyright free music because I want to prove to you guys that it actually works. Uh, to be honest. It sounds like it may act up a little bit, but it's just the way how the hardware responds to the new operating system. There you go. Now I got some commands on the keyboard and see if those work. There you go. Long control on the keyboard. So I hope this video was helpful to you guys that encountered this issue when installing Windows 10. And that's my proof that it worked. So. And the link will be in the description, which I know all you guys ask for, a link in the description. I can't find it anywhere, so it'll be in the description. So, see you guys later, and subscribe to my channel, everyone.